Alright, hey, it's Mac Helper. This is my first video ever. Well, using Screenium and putting a tutorial up, so don't hate too much. So today I'll be showing you how to get simple Minecraft mods on Minecraft, mainly too many items mod, but there's many mods just like it that only require dot class mods. So yeah, this is how it goes. So the links are in the description, both of them. There'll be a Rugasami's mod page, and there'll be a Too Many Items mod page. They're both Minecraft forms, so you gotta just scroll down. This is the Rugasami mods. Scroll down, just keep scrolling till it says the mods or donating message. Where it says the mods, it'll say mod loader beta. So go down and click on the download with grass fix. There you go. Just right there. Then go to the too many items link I gave you. Scroll down, scroll down, and then it'll say, "Ooh, little ad." What's this? Okay, I'm just saying there might an ad might pop up, but um, where it says download, it says download current version for 1.4. Click on that. Bring you to a media fire download. Click start downloading. Drag it down. There you go, you're done with the internet. So, drag that there. Drag that there. So, what you want to do is Mac comes with a basic unzipper. You don't need like the unarchive or anything. So, anyways, I do. So, all you, all you have to do is double click it and it'll, un it'll do it. So, these little files will pop up. Just drag them over here. Then, what you want to do is open Finder. Move it. Go to library. Well, on your user, go to library. Application support. Um, Minecraft. Bin. And here you'll in this bin you'll have these files. So what you want to do is right click on this. Go to compress. Right here. Now click on that, hit get info, right click, and it'll, you'll come up with this little box on the left hand side. Click right beside this, you can name it whatever you want, I usually just put dot. It can be anything different from minecraft.jar. So you can put minecraft l.jar or anything. So there it is right now. Now unzip this. It doesn't matter, yours will unzip it even if you don't have an archive or don't worry. Click, double click on it or open it up then I'll come up with all these weird classes things and some boxes that might happen or might open like armor art that's for big mods that's it you have to worry about those with big mods so what you do is go to it doesn't matter here we'll go to mod loader first these will pop up we see this terrain thing we don't need that just throw that in the trash unless well actually no you don't need it at all so what you're going to do is click at the bottom, drag up, and go to this little gear panel up here, and go copy 12 items. There, now close that. Now go back to the thing, click on the gear, same thing, paste items. It'll say whatever it asks you for, replace, just hit replace. Don't worry, you can always fix it if you don't like it. It, it doesn't matter if you're, well, when's you replace, you can fix it if it doesn't work for you and I'll show you guys how at the end of the video so what you do is go to too many items mod see this readme thing yeah throw it in the garbage alright so click at the bottom drag up see these classes do the same thing go to copy eight items close this go back here click on the gear and the paste eight items in again replace um so now you got the mods in here so now you want to go back, right click on the Minecraft file you just made, get info, but then make this dot jar. And it'll pop up this little box, click add. And um, then uh, with this it'll be like, this is like your main, uh, this is what runs your Minecraft now, it's that used to, and now this 
This is the base of your Minecraft, so anything you put in there will affect your Minecraft. So, there. Alright, what I was saying was, if you want to, um, fix your Minecraft, like, if you want to get, fix it without downloading Minecraft again, all you have to do is go to Command, click on Resources and Bin, and drag those to the trash, delete them, start up Minecraft again, and it'll re-download them when you open your Minecraft. And boom, it's fixed, and nothing's lost, except for the mods that you tried doing. So, anyways, after that, what you want to do is go to Minecraft. There, it's working, so just go to Login. Put this in full screen. There. So now you pop up with this again. So just go to create new worlds here. I'll just put like example. Um, most mods won't work with the previous world that you have because it'll be affecting the whole world. It'll. Uh, this is one of the only exceptions because all it is is changing your inventory. So, oh yeah, also, Glacier is an awesome seed with a capital G. It has to be capital G. Um, and, yeah, so most mods won't work that, so don't try doing an interface mod like a dinosaur or something and expect it to work on your previous worlds. So click Create New World. It's generating. Wait for it. There, so I'm waiting it for generate to generate a little waterfall. Oh, I just wondering what, if you're wondering what texture pack this is. This is um um a painterly pack custom. So you go and make your own texture pack. Just go and painterly pack Minecraft and and it, you see like if you hit it, it tells me like how weak it is or something. With rocks, it'll be less. Like it'll go, the numbers will go down slower. See two suns, you know, weird clouds. Sorry, it's it's very awesome. Glacier is a very awesome sea. Like, look at that cliff or the little waterfall. <laughs> All right, so um, just waiting for the loads because sometimes inventory edit crashes. So just go to your inventory, and this should pop up. If it doesn't, just hit O. And then, see, like, if I hit O, it hides it. If I hit O again, it pops it back up. So if it doesn't work, just hit O. Yeah. And, um, if it didn't work for you, then message me, and I'll try to walk you through it again, virtually, or on Skype or something. But, um, yeah, so this is it. And then on single player, it works on multiplayer also. Just make sure that the server has mods turned on. Hit O. Or inventory, click crafting table, and then boom, I have 64 crafting tables. With a lot of mods, inventory edit works, like spears or something like that. If you go to inventory edit, then also the spears will be in your inventory edit. But, um, anyways, yeah, that's it. And thanks for watching my first video. Please subscribe, and I swear I'll do personal walkthroughs with you if this doesn't work for you. All you have to do is subscribe, like, and favorite this video. Alright, see ya.